It is something that many of us have probably never heard of before. Prince metal angina. It's not a heart attack, but it can cause serious damage to heart muscle if not diagnosed and treated. And doctors aren't sure exactly what causes it. We introduce you now to one woman who is learning to manage this life-threatening condition. For Deb Utterbaugh, even simple things like a family card game are not something to be taken for granted. It's green. Yes, it is. Two years ago, Deb woke up feeling nauseous and knew something was terribly wrong. I text my husband, who knows what I text, because he came running upstairs, and I must have passed out. She had the, the blank stare, and she turned to ash gray. I'm you know, losing my mind to this day. I, it's something that I've never seen before. Deb was suffering the first of what would be four heart attacks in two years. Tests showed no blockage and no signs of heart disease in this otherwise fit and healthy then 48 year old. Take a deep breath and hold it. Doctors diagnosed her with Prince metal angina. Her pain was caused by coronary artery spasms. The muscles will contract, constricting these arteries and then limiting blood flow to the muscle that it supplies. My arteries go into spasm and on me, my body wants to twist them, cut off my own blood supply, and I usually lose consciousness when it happens. Deb keeps the spasms at bay with a cocktail of medications. This is my tear bag, and in this little pocket right here is where we keep my mom's nitro. While it's not something she wished for, Deb says her condition has made her family closer. I've learned to appreciate my kids in a different way. Yeah, you have to get... You have to... Doctors say it is important to know the signs of Prince metal angina, which may be simpler, similar to typical angina. Tightness in the chest, pressure, shortness of breath, sweating or palpitations. Those symptoms, though, usually happen when a person is at rest.